I'm Neil Brown. When disaster strikes your home or business, tell your insurance provider you prefer the restoration company, The Mountaineers Call. Panhandle Cleaning and Restoration. You can't really explain it. You know, you go to calls and like you make brothers, I guess, but like having your actual brother playing with you is just like something you can't even describe because it's like, okay, you got another one of you out there. I can't yell at him or he or like he can't yell at me like I, I yell at other people on the team because like if I yell at him, it like it's kind of just like, I can't explain it. I'm like, it's come like, on, come on, Do come, like, come on, come on, Dante, like, come on now. You know, you I'm know. I'm not having it. Like, but like <laughs> people on the team, you can't talk to them like that because they're just going to be like, ah. But like with or, your own brother, or it's kind of like, like He'll get mad. We'll get mad at each other. Oh, yeah, I get mad. Like, yeah, I'll be like, sure. Dante, shut up, bro. Just shut up. Let me play football. Just yeah. shut up. And he'll be like, all right, okay, okay, all, right, all right, all right. Our chemistry, you know, when we get on the field, either, you, either you're either you getting the ball or I'm getting the ball. And we're going to race to the ball. And whoever gets it. My dad always say, meet me there or beat me there. Meet me there or beat me there. Either you meet me there or I, I beat you. So every snap, we're like, meet me there, beat me there. <laughs> we go. As we start making plays and stuff, people kind of recognize us as like, OK, these two might be what our dad used to be and all that, but we're just two completely different players. He played more of a bandit linebacker type. He's a pass rusher. We're more of just interior guys. And people are starting to see, okay, like our dad, we have a little bit of our dad in us and also a bit of Darius and Dante in us. I watched a lot of film on him, like 98 season. And just watching him, I kind of like, I mean, as a dad, I don't see him as a legend because he's my dad. But like to other people, when they come up to us and ask us, it kind of like, gives us a big expectation amongst us to be just like him. But in our eyes, he's just our dad. And we know he's just a loving, caring dad that like, you know, every dad is. So it's kind of just like, kind of just like building off his legacy and, and stuff around, the stuff he did around here. So my main goal is just like, be as good as him or better. The quarterback McKay has the ball. It's a keep and he gets drilled down to the turf and sacked. Dante Stills got him. Dante's always been like naturally gifted at stuff. You know, I've always had to work harder than him and stuff. And just you dream about them type of moments. Driven down and sacked to the turf. It's funny when how things happen when you get a chance, you know. All people, some people need just one chance. And it's like, okay, like Dante, one chance. Now he got onto the opening. He's the freshman All-American here. I got one chance. Now I'm producing, like I'm starting to do, I'm doing good now. It's just like, okay. Maybe these people you slept on in the past or had a little bigger chip on your shoulder than the guys that you didn't sleep on. So it's like, okay, well now, as soon as they get their opportunity, they're gonna play best for you and they're gonna make plays for you. So it's just all about how hungry you are. Like, I appreciate that I have this opportunity here. Yeah. Like, kids from West Virginia don't really have, like, get scholarships with your brother. They get, And like, they play for their own home like state. Like, it's just like, it's not, it's not nothing compared to that. I tell people on the team, you know, it just hits different when you're from here and you're walking out of this tunnel, running out of this tunnel, you see all the people up in the stands. Families, like, just you know, everybody you growing up with is watching you play football and like watching how how your like journey was there. You know, people from Fairmont really see, okay, these guys came from Pee Wee to middle school to high school and it's just like they're here now.